Okay. Woo sa woo sa woo sa woo sa. Okay, this message is for Earth signs. What the heck? So is Virgo Capricorn. Let's see if we can get some messages for Earth signs. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Y'all is learning a lot. Y'all got a lot of patience with yourself. I know that much. Does anybody else? With all this pressure, people be trying to fake sense towards you. They would have been folded. But it's just something about you. You just can't fold, bro. I don't know. Mm-hmm. And most people have been like, oh, it's not good to like feel or think of yourself that way. But who else is going to do it? That's why I'm getting to the point where I don't care what people got to say. Yeah, just shine your light, okay? You will know who's for you or you will know who's not for you. Just period. And some people will pretend they're for you when they really not. Nah, bruh. See ya. We got the master. Okay? 15, which breaks down to a six. <clears throat> so something about a past life love is coming back around. Okay? You could be feeling like you're stuck at a crossroads or in between worlds. So you're definitely needing to take time to meditate so you can get the clarity that you need at this time. Okay? Because a lot of people are planning your energy right now. Okay? Let's see. I guess to drain you is not going to drain you. We got folk in the road. Yeah, it's like people trying to put you at a crossroads. So you could be confused on if you should keep moving forward or not. Like what? I don't care how much pressure people try to send my way. I will sit and like balance myself before I even sit up here to be like, oh, I'm stressed out, fuck it, and give up on what I know I'm called to do. Like what? I would rather just not record until I feel like I'm ready to record. It's just that simple. So y'all definitely got people trying to keep you stuck at a crossroads on your path so you won't know which way to go. Like they just want you to shut your heart system down so you can just be uh, in a very nasty energy or something like that, like a toxic energy. Because if you close your heart off and you just give up on everything, including things that you love, it's like it gives them the chance or the opportunity to win when these people already lost. But they just keep going. As I said, these people are going to just keep doing all this stuff until <clears throat> they literally just perish. I mean, that ain't got nothing to do with me. We got never-ending story. Exactly. These people are just in a never-ending cycle, so they want you to be in a never-ending cycle. Okay? Some of these people don't like the fact that you can actually, like, stand on your own or something like that. So, so these are codependent energies, codependent people. Okay? Mm -mm. And these people sit and observe and watch you all day. That's all they can do with themselves is watch you. They don't have nothing else to do but watch you. I mean, which is cool. Ain't nothing wrong with that, but still find something to do. Okay? Yeah, I don't like the fact that you was very hard working. Well deserved rewards. Some of these people feel like you don't deserve what you're getting. Yeah, co-create and bless it. Some of you guys are creating a whole new atmosphere or for yourself. You will be seeing a lot of fairies or butterflies. Okay. Stars could be significant as well. Okay. I don't know why I'm getting like sunflowers. You could be seeing a lot of sunflowers. A rainbow. Regeneration. It's like you keep regenerating yourself. You just keep <laughs> reinventing yourself. So somebody or some people or whoever this is, like it's getting to the point where I don't even care anymore. Okay. Like these people energy, they just disgust me. Cause it's like, bruh, like all this time and energy you doing. You could be doing, like, putting it into yourself. It's like these people don't want you to surpass them. Like, for some particular reason. But it's just, like, it's not stopping you. Like, it might try to slow you down, okay? Like, you understand that. 
being slowed down or being blocked, okay, for the meantime, between time. But after that, it's go time. Like, you just go back to your balance. So, I hope you guys are just meditating a lot, okay? To just stay in a very calm, peaceful energy. Like, having patience with yourself. It's like, self-mastery is the energy I'm getting. And you're mastering yourself, and that's the thing. People don't want you to master who you are. But when you are a master teacher, eh, that's what comes with it. Okay? Yeah, new life, all that glitters. <sighs> How can I say this? Hmm. I'm just going to say someone is not who they say they are, and they know they're not. But they know that you know they're not. But I guess we're going to see how long this game going to keep being played. Fine, fine, fine. Okay. <clears throat> it's like people trying to see. I don't know what people trying to see. It's just like starting to be irritating with these people. Yeah, poised. It's because look at your energy. You're just too graceful. <laughs> You're just too graceful. Like, you change your focus. You know what to give your energy to and what not to give your energy to. These people don't. Or this person or whoever this is at this point. Because they're stuck at making a decision. Okay? Or they keep getting drawn back to the same shit they want to get out of. Like, what? I don't know what this person got going on. But they just need to keep you out of it because if this person is trying to, like, be with you and someone else, it's like, no, this person just needs to stay where they're at. Just period. Because somebody's definitely wearing a mask. It's like somebody wants to be a part of your life, but they also is stuck. Anywho. Anyway. Yeah. But this person is like, they... <laughs> They not gonna let you go. We got why and unfinished business. So this person is like questioning themselves, like why are you leaving them? Like why? Why are you about to walk away or why? Like this person know why. We ain't about to keep acting slow like that. Okay? This person know why you're leaving or why you're saying what you're saying or why you're yeah. It's too much chaos and confusion. Like it's just too much. Earth signs. I don't know if this is someone you're dealing with or someone you're thinking about or Someone you know, okay? Yeah, we got teacher in no place like home. Some of you guys, you are a teacher, so you know these things. You teach these things, okay? You give life and give birth into these things, whether it's towards people, places, or things, okay? And you're very intuitive. You see how she's sitting in a purple? So purple is significant, okay? And you got like a loyal dog beside you. Okay, so that could be like your spirit animal, dogs. Okay, for some of you, you do have a loyal companion that's around you or beside you or trying to come towards you. That's what that dog is. I'm trying, I'm here, I gotta find my way back, way back. Somebody needs to find their way back to you. Okay, it's like they, they can't waste any more time. I'm hearing somebody say, I ain't trying to waste your time. But y'all do got people that is wasting your time. That's pretty. And we have soulmates. Dang, I ain't see this flow and seek the truth. Yeah, for some of you, because it's like when you stay in your heart chakra, you can see who the real from the fake. Like, you can differentiate the real from the fake. When you're in your heart chakra, it's just that simple. Yeah. Okay. And I don't know if somebody's like, Trying to make you feel like you're a helpless or a hopeless romantic. Like, I don't see that. I feel like you're trying to put your focus on yourself, but you got other people focused on you and what you got going on. Okay? Like, it's a lot of competition surrounding you. And it's like people want you to put your attention onto drama. Because if you stay focused onto drama, it'll close your heart chakra off. Or if you in this very uptight, tense, ag agitated, frustrated, annoyed, mad, angry, upset energy, 
it will block you from who the person that you're supposed to be with because you will continue to be blinded to it because your heart chakra will be closed off. That's why I just stay grounded as possible. Like, be patient with yourself. Yeah, the seven of pentacles and seek. Yeah, just be patient with yourself. Okay. It's because you cleanse your cleanse your energy and these people out of your life. So some of you have been calling your energy back because they know something is coming true towards you or other people. Whether if it's dreams of your own or dreams of being with someone or getting a new home or whatever it is that these blessings are. Just period, earth signs. Because we do have 999 out here. And nines are significant. It's all about endings of cycles within yourself. So that way you can be able to teach and guide others. Okay. For some of you, you're about to be a teacher. Like I'm talking about actually in like the school systems and stuff like that. For some of you, you work for the government. I don't know why I just heard informant. What the hell? Okay, whatever that supposed to mean. Somebody need to watch the people there around. Oh, who comes to? I don't know. Look, I ain't got time for. <laughs> like I really don't. <clears throat> That's just messy. It's something about messy energy. People want you to like be intrigued with. Like you're supposed to be. A TikTok, okay. So it's definitely towers hitting or tower moments are happening or epiphanies or realizations or it can be just time is running out. Okay. Some of you people miss can be missing someone or longing for someone. For others of you you could be on like a picnic or a date or somewhere out in the park somewhere. Okay, like under a tree. I don't know why I'm getting like paint and sip. Some of you guys can be doing paint and sip. <clears throat> Others of you could be like on this like bike trail. Okay, riding a bike. Something about the zoo could be something. You could be going to the zoo or you're at the zoo. For others of you, someone has you in a book or something like that. Like somebody is sitting up here. Writing your name in a book, putting your name in a book, putting stuff about you in a book. It's something about a book somebody is doing. <clears throat> like somebody wants your life. I don't know if they keep doing something pertaining your name and their name and trying to switch it or swap it around like on some weird stuff. Or signs. But somebody definitely is taking notes on you. Like you're in a book or something like that. <clears throat> Why well, just heard a book of thieves? What the hell? <laughs> okay. So we got people that just be going around sorting out the people. 1333, they just be going to look for people, searching people and shit, looking people up. Like, what is this? Mm-mm. I'm going to need for people to really take several seats. Okay. Let's see. Never end this story. Yeah, someone wants to be you and it's becoming very awkward. Because with this person in this mirror right here, I guess because somebody is falling out of love with them or something, 1414, so they're trying to like keep up this image of being in love with someone or falling in love with somebody. I don't know. And that's the thing with stuff is mutual or is genuine. It's like you don't have to force somebody to love you. It just comes naturally. But somebody is like literally upset at the fact that they can't portray to be you anymore or any longer. Because somebody is awakening to that. Like somebody's mask around them is slipping. That's why I say somebody is like literally studying you to the T with this damn mirror in their hand trying to be you. But the more 
that they're trying to be you and stressing them out because look, you see how they are like this with their wings and you are like this with your wings. It's two different people with wings, two different set of energies of wings. You are like this, I don't know why I'm hearing Lotus Flower. You are like this Lotus Bomb. Now I'm thinking of uh, the song. You're just gracefully just blossoming. And this person is like losing their mind. That's why I said it's this person that's projecting their energy onto you. So if you've been having like disturbances in your home, like pertaining with your keys or you're just getting out of your element all of a sudden it's because somebody is projecting onto you because they don't like the way that they feel, the way that they look. They don't like nothing about who they are or who they created themselves to be. And then it's like when they look at you, it it, it it irritates their demons or some shit like that. And the thing is, it's like everybody has choices to be in the energy that they choose to be in. Why do people keep blaming you for being in the energy that you chose to be in? As I said, by them being at a crossroads, it's trying to make you be at a crossroads. And before I even started this reading, I like to y'all that NBA Young Boy whole album <clears throat> came up on my phone, and Crossroads was the first song that I heard. Sixteen, sixteen. Like if somebody can swap lives with you or get you to cross over so they can take over your life, like it's not happening like that. No, but this is. It's just not. Like, somebody just keeps going to the crossroads demons to, like, cross their lives over with you. Like, swap lives with you or something like that. That's why they probably keep doing stuff in this book. And it's not doing nothing but binding them to the book. Because all their energy is going in. People got to realize here, okay? When you write stuff down intent, like with your intentions or with your motives, whatever that is for you, you placing all of your energy into that book, into that item. So if you feel as though you're saying, okay, I want to do this and this, then the third to this person. Or I want this, then the third done to that person. Not knowing that with those same intentions that you wrote into that book is the same intentions that you're manifesting, placing upon yourself. That's why they say like words are very powerful. Even when you write. That's why the most famous authors are like, of Shakespeare, William Shakespeare and shit like that. Because they was very intensive when it came to their creations of being an artist. Like, this shit is deep. It just don't go from, oh, you just using words to say you want this, that, and the third done to people. Like, that's not how that works. Especially if you're not powerful enough to even cast those spells in that book. Like, somebody has a book of spells that they just cast around on people or they write shit on people and not knowing that them same, the same energy that this person is putting into them books is the same energies that's happening around it. Like literally. That's why somebody is like, why are my wings like this and this person is still flourishing? Because this is two different sets of people right here. Somebody is stuck in a never-ending cycle of their life, okay, because they portrayed an image or made a mirror image of what their life should look like or what their life could be because that's what they wanted. And then turned around and see you still flourishing because they feel it's like you supposed to be at the crossroads. You supposed to be you, 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 you. No. That's because this person is giving too much about, get, they caring too much about you and your energy. When they could be creating their own energy. I, I, mm, mm. I'm telling you, these people are starting to become late at this point. It's like, I'm really starting to get. <laughs> and it's like, I understand because these people are sent to me for a reason. So I'm understanding why. I have karmic people coming towards me because if in my chart and my Saturn return is Capricorn energy. So all these toxic people is being led to me for a reason to either get served their karma or to get served their Dharma. It's like, you got to choose. That's why I say why people trying to study my chart. I'm already in the movement, the movement of it. At the most y'all can do is try to slow me down and block it, but I'm still doing what I'm called to do to help y'all as in karmics. Or just karmic people or karmic energies. Like, which one is it? 
That's why it's to the point where it goes like, I don't even get mad and upset no more. I just be like, okay. And I just hope that you guys can take the lesson that I'm giving to y'all to learn from. Or whatever I'm explaining to y'all for y'all to get. Because we all was in karmic energy before. But the thing is, it's like, I learned to like sit with my eyes and deal with it. Whether it's anger issues, being heartbroken and hurt, um, insecurities and all that stuff there. It's like some people can't do that. Because they, they, they want to like push their stuff onto other people. And you can't do that. Like you block your own blessings trying to block somebody else's stuff. That's why I said like I understand why y'all is being led and guided to me. It's all making sense now. Why I have more karmic energies attracted to me than high vibrational people. It's because y'all is being led to me for a reason. I'm here to serve you your karma or your dharma. You choose. It's up to you. Because I'm already in mass. You feel me? <laughs> it's like I'm already in mass. Yeah. That's what I said. Like these people that come into your life, they think they got it all figured out. They think they got it all figured out. Oh, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that. You don't even know what you were sent to me for, baby. It's either like you want a good life or you're going to deal with your consequences of your actions from the past. Like, y'all need to stop playing around. Like, the age that we're in right now, all that shit is changing. Like, it's either get with the program or get lost. You got to figure it out. So, trying to put me in the crossroads is only going to, like, you got to get through me to get to either side. <laughs> Pick a side, pick a side. That's why y'all keep coming right here. That's, that's why y'all just keep coming to me with this stuff y'all got going on, trying to, like, take me off my pivot. And I can never get off my pivot because I know what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay? So, once again, why you trying to put me at the crossroads? I am the crossroads. <laughs> and my daughter laughing. It's not to be like that. It's because I am. Like for real, my my north nose in Scorpio. I'm I'm called a death and transformation, awakenings. So by you dealing with me, it's awakening you. Zoe, come on, boo. Look, I have this. Sit right there, Aiden. So, mm mm. And then it's like people so quick to try to have your identity and swap ro swap roles with you, and if they was to have this role, they wouldn't even know how to handle it because they would get attacked daily by so many negative forces that they would lose their mind. Literally, you know how much how, how much I get attacked each and every day, but I still know how to control myself. Don't get me wrong, I do let it out, but it gotta go somewhere. But I'm not putting it out towards other people to harm them and hurt them and, and, and make them feel some kind of way. Like, who does it? Everybody say it. Mm, mm, mm. So, it's understandable. Why I have more karmic energy sent to me than any other energy. Because my energy can handle it. I didn't send it so high. It's like, it's just, it's just going to bounce off of me. It's like a repellent. Oh. I'm already shielded and armored. That's why I know most people are like, damn, why we can't take her out? Like, why, why we got to keep doing all this to take her out? Because it's not meant for me to be taking her out. I already know. Mommy, what am I supposed to do to help y'all? Which I don't mind helping. That's what I say. Because I don't have no hate towards my enemies or nothing like that. I love everybody equally in the same. It's just I'm going to wish y'all the best. Even if you are an enemy to me. I'm not going to wish on your downfall like y'all do with me. I don't do tick for tack. Because I know how that shit go. So what you wish on me. I'm just going to wish good to you. Because that same good I'm wishing to you. Always going to come back to me. You feel me? As I said. I really need to know some shit. Uh, some of the shit people would say, oh, I knew to know you did. Because if you did, you wouldn't be doing the same fuck shit you keep doing every other year. Every other month. Every other week. Every other day. 
It's the same old shit, just a different day. Like for real. It's just not adding up no more. It's not making sense. Mommy. Hmm? Yeah, I see. Mm-hmm. It's just not making sense. I'm supposed to be doing y'all one piece every time. I just wanted to say that, though. Mm -hmm. That's why I said people need to really pay attention to where their placement's at. And their chart. That's why I said I'm just starting to get immune to the, um... The karmic um energies y'all keep throwing towards me. Cause I don't really been there done it. I know how that she feels. To be rageful. Not to just be rageful rageful for no reason. I I be having reasons. But you came to me to learn how to balance out that anger you got in you. What you angry for? What you mad at yourself? The night is wolves. Exactly. Why are you so rageful? Who you rage and war at? Yourself? I'm a reflection of you. That you were afraid to be. Because of what everybody else got going on. Or because you just want to be complacent and comfortable. Which one is it? Hmm? And it's not that for me to intimidate nobody or pump nobody. Because I damn sure ain't no bully. I know how I feel to be bully too. That's what I'm saying. Like... Come on, now. We all done been there, done that. But I'm real about mine. I ain't afraid to say it. Because I know I'm no better than the next person. I have flaws and all that shit. I have imperfections and all that. I just learned how to love mine. So if you want to be a part of me, or you are a part of me, you got to learn how to do that too. Just period. We got the five of him. Because it's like, at some point in your life, you're not going to keep wanting to have these weak individuals in, like around you. Because it's like, if you keep having people that drain you, suck from you, take from you, make you feel less than, or they just drain you overall, period. Every day you irritated, you, you upset, you mad, you frustrated. And that's a sign you being drained. There's nothing left to give to that. So it's like you gonna um wind up dying or being old and sick or whatever the case may be because you angry all the time. And that's the truth. Like why you wanna be angry all the time? If somebody makes me to the point where I'm angry and rageful all the fucking time, I'm not gonna wanna be around you. Hell no. Like I'm just not. Cause when I like quiet and peace, that's what I like. So we can hear each other's thoughts. Not we just sitting there being, we mad as shit. Like, what? We just rage through all that. Like, somebody has some resentment towards somebody, but they still in it. Like, still dealing with it. Still around it. Yeah, this emperor who wants to talk to you, who wants to come towards you, actually. But they're just in, like, this rageful energy. Like, they can't leave or... It's like they want to leave. I don't know. It's back and forth. That's what I say. Some people, they just get complacent. It's like being comfortable in something that you know is not making you happy anymore. That's what I say. It's better. It's easy said than done. The eight of wands. It's easy said than done. But sometimes you gotta count your losses and keep it moving, man. Cause the more you stay in it, the more you're gonna lose. Like you're not getting anything, gaining from it. All you're doing is just being verbally attacked every day by somebody. And they send them here getting you in your bag. Like you get out of your feelings and get in your bag. Just that simple. And once you do that, you ain't gotta worry about being mad, angry, and upset in nobody. Because what you want to come to you. And I think that's what somebody know how to do. They know how to get to you by saying shit to you. And this person be saying all types of sideways shit to you and all that. 
Like this person know what they doing. I don't know who this is. It could be a man or a woman. They they slick with the mouth. Like they know what to say to get you out of your element and all that. Like you be ready to shoot some shit up with this mighty souls. I'm telling you. It's the Emperor the Page of Wands. The Three of Wands. Yeah, this person at a distance from you. They want you to come back to them. Or you them. Take away everything. Why is this three of swords? Three of Wands here, excuse me. The Seven of Wands. But this person is being like blocked right now. Now, whether it could be a physical interference or a spiritual interference with this block that's happening. Get off the table, though. Sorry, you guys. My apologies. And it's like somebody know that they're being defeated. Where they at? It's just this person don't know how to leave. I don't know. Uh, just leave? I don't know. Look. I can only bite. I don't know. Yeah, that's what somebody is going to do. We got the Tower, the Chariot, the Hierophant, the Strength, the Nine of Wands, and the Nine of Pentacles. What's this Eight of Wands? Okay. I don't know if somebody said a hit out on you. Earth signs. <laughs> With the ten of swords, it's a swords. That's how you know envy go like envy be real. This is ace of swords. Ace of wands. All because you're about to have a passion and beginning with somebody and people are watching you. Or watching this King of Swords or this King of Swords watching you. Okay. What's throwing me off is for some of you, this emperor could be younger than you or they just very immature. Okay. I don't know. I think so. They just immature page of wands. This person is who's blocking you. What's the seven of wands? They had five of wands. Like this person is petty or something like that. Or they want to be petty or they try to be petty. To block you. Mm, 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 mm. Why is this five of wands here? <clears throat> So we got masculine energy in competition with you. This person is way down and burning. They got a lot of drama around them. For others of you, it's like someone is like, just keep fighting with something or somebody at a distance. It's like a bunch of rage. As I said, how can you sit around and be angry all day? I can't deal with it. I don't want to deal with it. Like, the hostility, the animosity. Like, you can feel the tension from a mile away. Like, you sitting around people or you sitting around a person and you know they don't like you. Or you know that they got hate towards you or something. I don't know. I just can't do it. I just can't. Because it's like every five seconds I got to watch my back when I'm around you. Because you can snake me. If you got all this energy towards me now, just imagine when we'll we are together. Mm -mm. Like, just imagine. That's what I want to know. I could just imagine. Man, the betrayal. Put it right there. Give me more spirit. I'm going to close this out for Earth time. Yeah, we got Twin Flame, Yin Yang, Zen, Duality, Balance. Okay. So for some of you, you are coming together with your person.
to break in harmony and balance, and that's the truth. Okay? This person can feel like that if they get with you, they will get some form of protection or something like that. And something dealing with your protection or how protected you are. Um, go over there, though. We got the dragonfly of things coming to light. Hmm. Maybe someone's going to tell you that they changed or they're just going to open up to you. The boat. Okay, now I'm getting the energy. Look. This is too much going on. And we got a karmic relationship, girl with a snake and the runner. Hmm. Someone is running after you after leaving someone else. They found out there's a snake or an enemy. Okay. What is this? <sighs> it say focus on self, love bombing, meeting and conversing and dating. So someone is dating more than one person. Say healthy choices in love and in life, happiness, paradise, expansion, and butterfly, and abundance. Hmm. So some of you guys are making healthy choices, whether that's going towards your abundance or it's like just focusing on you and yourself. I told you you got people mirroring you. I just don't know what else to say about this energy, y'all. I really don't. <laughs> like it's like once you just said enough it's like what else left did you say I mean cause the ace of swords is already so it's like what more could we say about this situation okay someone is definitely carrying a lot okay going through a lot and they're nervous about something whether it's coming towards you Page of cups. I think this person, whatever it is, they just need to say it. Whatever it is. Mm -mm. All right, Earth Science. I hope this message helps and resonates. I love you guys so very much. I know it probably wasn't as exciting. Because this energy, earth signs, it's like, y'all just in this energy of like, I don't know. It's like, you just in that energy. Mm -hmm. I don't know what kind of energy I am. Because it's just too much going on around y'all. Mm. Yeah, I think I just need to yeah, say I'm just in a really dark space. I need a healing. That's probably why. Because somebody is in like a very dark space right now. So it's like to make out their emotions and feelings, they're going to be closed off. It say everything you said to me was true. I had to learn the hard way. Yeah, that's probably why somebody is just like. And that could be another thing this person know when they face you because this person is going to come towards you and face you this person was doing black magic on you too yeah this person got a lot of apologizing to do they just want you to hear them out And say, I apologize if I made you not trust me. All I ask is for you to believe in me. I will show you my true love and pure honesty. I hid a lot of my secrets that I should have discussed openly. But now I learned you're the best part of me. Yeah, this is just the divine masculine saying. Oh, it said the first time I laid eyes on you, you took my breath away. I love you. I needed to resolve some things in my life before coming to you. Yeah, buddy. That's why this person is like, 
Mm -hmm. I guess they want to see how you feel first before coming to you because some of you you don't even know that this is what this person got going on and some of you do yeah because this person wear a mask they say I wear a mask to cover my true emotions for you I'm always looking at your photos oh and they say I'm mm -mm -mm. this person is still connected to someone but they want to be with you and they say, I've been stuck at a crossroads for too long. I'm ready to grow elevate. Yeah, somebody is ready to boss up. So you inspire me and molded me to become a better person. Yeah, boy. Now I'm getting... Uh, <clears throat> That's better energy right there. Because I ain't like that energy at first. It's like this person's just like, man, what the f did I do? That's how this person is. They're like, what the F did they do? Listening to the wrong people when you could have asked questions. Let me see, come Or maybe this person was. Uh, this is just not listening to your own better judgment. That's all. But now you know, Earth Science. Now you know. Okay. But yeah, so like, share, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell note. Peace.